Every couple of weeks, staff at the Downtown Partnership take stock of the cranes up in Nashville. And we keep up with that number. We report it to our board. It's pretty, pretty tremendous. Right now, there are 20 cranes sprinkled throughout downtown, helping build our city. Ten years ago, this is what our skyline looked like. A few standouts like the Batman building. But for Tamara Dixon at the Downtown Partnership, one building was the start of it all. You know, I look back to 2013 and a huge catalyst was the Music City Center. That just seemed to spur um, a lot of the development and a lot of the excitement downtown. There have been 86 projects in downtown Nashville in the last 10 years. 34 hotels, 34 residential buildings, 16 office buildings, 14 of them with 25 stories or more. It's still shocking to us. We live and breathe it every day, but you know, you're going in increments. And to, to stand back and look and see how just how far we've come is, is amazing. It started with the Westin in 2016 with 27 stories, then the Bridgestone Tower in 2017 with 30 stories. The iconic 505 in 2018 has 46 stories. Later that year, the Marriott with 34 stories. Fifth and Broadway the following year with 34 stories. And 501 Commerce in 2020. 805 Lee, Embassy Suites, and the Conrad in 2021. Then the biggest of them all, the Four Seasons with 40 floors. I loved so much when the Four Seasons came into the market because I think that really changed a lot. I think it changed people's perception. 2023 brought Amazon Tower 2. And so far this year, the Alcove and Prime with 34 and 38 stories respectively. Skyscrapers aside, the filler buildings around them are also adding to the skyline, including 752,000 square feet of retail just since 2014. When we look back over the last 10 years, we've had 8.6 billion in public private investment, which is pretty amazing. And then you look at you know, 10 years from now, and we're gonna be at 16 billion in public private investment um, coming into downtown. We like to think that downtown is the economic engine of the region. Downtown produces 18.8% of the retail taxes and 11.8% of the property taxes in less than one half a percent of the land area of Davidson County. Maintaining this growth is not without its challenges, and the downtown partnership says their focus is on balance. Momentum, yeah. growth. Growth is great. Now we focus on live, work, play, and invest, mm -hmm. and we really feel um, excited about the growth. We're excited about where downtown Nashville and the city of Nashville is, um, especially on a national stage. Nikki Burdine, News 2.